Hello everyone. Today we understand isomorphic graph in graph theory. First of all, we understand what is a graph. A graph is a ordered set of vertices and edges where vertices is represented by v1, v2, v3, and vn, and edges is represented by e1, e2, e3, and so on. Where every edge is a connection between vertices. Now we understand about the isomorphic graph. What is a isomorphic graph? If there are two graphs g1 and g2 with vertices v1 and v2 and edges e1 and e2 respectively, that are called isomorphic to each other if and only if there is a bijection between vertices v1 and v2. So, first of all, we consider how can say that two graphs are not isomorphic. Then we analyze. What is the main constraint for a isomorphic graph? In the isomorphic graph, we one thing or one thing more preserved is adjacency. If there are two vertex A and B, is called adjacent if and only if if they share a one edges. Or if we have a another vertex C with E two edges, then B and C. Is also adjacent, but A and C is not adjacent because of there is no edges between the vertex A and C. Now, again, we find out how can say that two graphs are not isomorphic. First of all, if G1 and G2 not have not have same number of vertices, first same number of edges. And same degree and sequence, then it is not isomorphic. Then we analyze G1, G2 mapping functions, that bijections or not. Bijection means they follow a property of one one and on two. For all, if there are two vertex V1 and W, are Edges. Then, if we apply a map function f and f with another vertex, then it show the edges of graph G. That is known as a bijection mapping. So we analyze a first function with graph that is isomorphic or not. First of all, we check. Graph G1 and G2 are isomorphic or not? First, find out number of edges. There are one, two, three, four, five, and six vertex, and six vertex. It means G1, G2 have a same number of vertex. Then check same number of edges. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and eleven. So, G one and G two have same number of edges. Then, check degree sequence. If we there consider degree of sequence, then consider there is A have three degree, B have four, C have three. D have four, F have four, and E have four. Again, check for graph G two, four, four, three, four, three, and four. Four, 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 four times four and two times three. Four, 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 three and three. It means the degree sequence or vertex sequence is also same. It means that maybe a isomorphic graph. Then again, we check for a bijection map function. Then we consider six vertex from the graph G1 and six graph six vertex from graph G2. Where is A is similar to the six, B is similar to the one, C three, D to F, E to T, or F to four. If we apply A function on vertex of v1 
like A and F vertex of D. It means we are talking about this S. Then that provide vertex of 6 and 1. This is. That's known as isomorphic graph. So, a isomorphic graph that follow have following properties. First is connectedness. If one graph is connected, then another graph is also connected. Number of connected are same. Same number of loops and multiple edges. If there is a subgraph, if subgraph is isomorphic, it means its other graph is also maybe more so isomorphic. Number of cycles are same. May look different, but rename using rename vertices and isomorphic preserve as property like cycle and degree of vertex. If a linear check for isomorphism, then computation time is order of CK in a polynomial function. An isomorphic graph have the same set of subgraphs. And if one is pipetted, complete and valid, then isomorphism is also have the same. Next, we think about next two graphs, G1 and G2. Where is number of vertices are same, 8, number of edges are 10, same, and degree of sequence are same. But they are not a isomorphic graph. Why? Because there is no rule between G1 and G2 as a bijection mapping function. So there is there are A, B, C, D, E, F, G and H and G2 have vertex 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 and 8. If we consider a vertex A that have degree 3 and vertex V1 1 with degree 3, then we can connect A with V. There is A is connected another degree of 3 is E. It means 5, we can select 5 and 2. So E is connected to the 5 and any 2. But now V1 connect to the another degree of vertex with 2 degree, but there is only 2 degree. So it is not possible. Bijection is not like this. It means this graph is not a isomorphic graph. There are, we have some exercise for you. You try to check its isomorphic property and why it is not. And if it is exist, then explain it. There are some of exercise. You try for that and check this isomorphic property. Thank you. See you next time. Thanks.